producers in the Tompkins Gears Stake, sponsored by Budget Car and Truck Rental. One is 50% of a Marshall and Lois Field, trained and driven by Chris Boring. The two is twice a Raider, owned by Sawick, Cushing, Makama, and Strzok, trained and driven by Ron Cushing. Three is Caviar Jackson, owned by Judith and Clarence Chaffee. Jim Arledge Jr. trains Dallas Miller Drives. Four is Really Shady, owned by Adelbert Kemp and Alan Keith, trained by Mike Roth with Dave Hawk. Five is Inmate, owned by Lewis Gerges and Bill Zent. Bill Zent trains and drives. Six Meadowland Partner, owned by the partnership of Hoobler and Metters. Mike Metters trains. Jeff Nysunger is up. Seven is Standish Hanover, owned by Burke Chiricello. Jones and Burke, trained by Mickey Burke Sr. with Brian Sears. And the aide is Willie Hanover, owned by FTF Incorporated, conditioned by Ron Potter and driven by Todd Jones. That's your field, six minutes until post time. Three-year-old Pacers are lined up for the start. And they're off. It goes really shady, and Dave Hawk out for the lead. Meadowland partner joins that one from the outside. Then it's a gap of three farther back, and Willie Hanover comes away nicely, dipping down to the inside third, two lengths farther back to twice a Raider in fourth position, 50 some. 50% rather is racing in fifth. Another two and a half to Caviar Jackson, followed by Inmate and Standish Hanover is last as they roll to head stretch. And really, Shady and Dave Hawk win that early fight for command. They open up in 27 and 2. Passing the stands for the first time, it's really Shady on top by length and a quarter. Tracked by Meadowland Partner in the pocket second. It's two back. Willie Hanover is third. Followed by twice a Raider in fourth position. Moving to the outside fifth is 50%. And now he gains cover from Willie Hanover, who's up out of the three hole. Next, we have Caviar Jackson, followed by Standish Hanover, an inmate, has been shuffled back to the trailing spot as they round the clubhouse turn. Really shady. Leads at three quarters of a length. He'll now be pressed from the outside by Willie Hanover in second. The half goes in 58 and one. Along the rail, Meadowland partner at ground saving third. Two and a half off the lead is 50% on the outside in fourth. Followed by twice a Raider at the rail in fifth. Another two back to Caviar Jackson. Followed by Standish Hanover and inmate is last eight off the lead. Five sixteenths of a mile remaining as they head for the far turn. It's really shady leading a half a length. Willie Hanover is still putting pressure on from the outside second. Meadowland partner a very snug third and Chris Boring tips three wide with 50% on the far outside and he's in gear 126 flat. Moving around to the head of the stretch. Really Shady leads the way. 50% on the far outside comes in a second. Meadowland partner looks to dip down to the passing lane. Twice a Raider drops out of an extreme outside. Caviar Jackson as they turn down the lane. And it's Really Shady all out. 50% on the outside is coming strong. Followed by Caviar Jackson. 50% strikes the front. It's 50% to score. Then it was Caviar Jackson second. Meadowland partner third in 155. Back in the winner's circle is 50%. Six wins in seven starts on the season. The fourth consecutive victory for 50%, 155. A three-year-old Bay Colt by Jade Lobel out of half dozen by Precious Bunny. Owned by Marshall and Lois Field of Rochester Hills, Michigan. The winning trainer driver is Chris Boring. Scoring in the second division of the Tompkins Gears three-year-old Colt Pace again, 155.